We've all been sick. We all know that when you're sick and you're coming back to health, that meal means so much. And I think it's a huge part of the healing experience. It's important to have good food in a hospital. It's a large part of the patient experience. 10, 20 years ago, maybe that wasn't really the focus. The focus was on healing the patient, getting the patient you know, back to health as soon as possible. I think today people have a choice as to where they want to go. And um, believe it or not, people have told me that they choose Huntington for the food. Of course, the care is great too, but to be told that it's because of the food, is it's amazing. It can be daunting sometimes because there's a lot of moving parts. Our production list is probably over 150 items that need to be prepared fresh every day. Everything from uh, strawberries cut in half to making fresh pizza dough. And when you're a chef, you love what you do. You want to make good food. So to have people who are like-minded with the same goal, it's a wonderful atmosphere. I knew it was going to be different when I saw the menu because it had everything that I was looking for. Not only to please everybody, but to excite everybody with the options and the quality of food. Any patient request, and regardless of the diet, you know, we've told all staff members and everyone knows that it's, it's our mission, whatever it is, we've got a refrigerator full of food. We can do anything. Our sole focus is to provide patients with something that they can look forward to. The patients all receive a menu when they come in, and that menu is a room service menu. It looks just like pretty much a, a restaurant menu. Pick whatever you want on that menu from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Our call center intercepts all the phone calls. Extremely friendly people on the phone. They know what the food tastes like. They can describe it to patients, because it's really hard to sell food if you don't know what it tastes like yourself. I was going to order the avocado toast, but then I realized that wasn't a good um, meal for my condition at the time. So I just went with the cream of wheat and the porridge and the coffee. I think I ordered puddings. Then when the food came, I was just like aghast because the berries <laughs> were just so huge and so fresh. I mean, the coffee was delicious. I really felt like I was in a gourmet restaurant. I was just overwhelmed, and that's why I wrote a letter. You feel like the people are there for you, that they care about you. They want your experience to be as, as good as possible, especially due to the circumstances. What's most rewarding for me are the commentaries that we get from patients directly. The letters from people like Lauren. People will take a napkin and write a note on it. Those are really from the heart. Whenever we get them, we post them up. We make sure that everyone knows that our work is recognized and everything that we do is, it's just a great thing to do. Prior to 2017, when we were not on room service, our scores were probably in like the 16th percentile nationally. Um, so they weren't very good. Today, we sit at the 97th percentile for quality of food, which is it's amazing, the journey that we've been on. It's just the most rewarding thing when people aren't feeling well, to be able to provide them a good meal and it, it brings a lot of joy to them. You love making good food, but making food where it makes a difference is really special.